Initial coin offerings are some of the hottest opportunities to make money in the cryptocurrency market at the moment. But which ones do we choose? In today's episode, we're going to look at ProStarter, which is going to be huge in the NFT space and find out how you can get involved in the early stage sale of ProStarter. Guys, hello and welcome to the House of Crypto. I make videos on Ethereum, Bitcoin, as well as other cryptocurrencies and ICOs. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button to be kept up to date with all of the latest happening in the markets. Today's video is brought to you by ProStarter. ProStarter is a community-centric and transparent DeFi platform introducing its own token in the cryptocurrency market. The mission of the ProStarter project is to offer safe, fast, and smart transactions in a hassle-free environment. ProStrata is coming up with token sales, auctions, fundraising, and much more for the whole of the crypto community. It's going to be particularly big in the NFT space, which is what makes it such an exciting product, in my opinion. One of the first things we want to do every time we get uh, an ICO and we take a look at it is come over to etherscan.io and we can come down to here where it says contract and we can see the name of the contract, which is prop token. And as you can see, uh, source code verified okay so that's always very key to to look into because there are a lot of scams and things out there but this lets us know that this is not a scam and is therefore a viable uh, cryptocurrency for us to potentially invest in if we like that product so first of all what is pro starter so every time we look at icos again you know we want to be looking at the problems they're trying to solve think are they actually useful problems that they're trying to solve and how is that ICO saying that it's going to solve the problem? Okay, so if we look down here, we've got problems ProStarter is trying to solve. Single chain network dependency, transparency of the whitelisting selection process, separate KYC submission problems, uh, and issues regarding sale and purchase of assets between blockchains. So why ProStarter? Following the potential of DEX, ProStarter has been developed with an aim to offer safe and transparent cross-chain launchpad. Many companies have started building blockchain-based projects, which is a good thing for the future. Many of them are startups and don't have enough funds to afford the development cost of their blockchain projects, which is why ProStarter is here. ProStarter is an inexpensive way for every startup or project to reach investors for fundraising because investors do trust on DeFi platforms like ProStarter. Built on cross-chain, ProStarter provides transparent and fair opportunities for the whole of the crypto community, including investors and startups. As I mentioned in a previous video where we're talking about Chainlink and VeChain, there was a, there's a big problem when um, startups are trying to get funding, okay? Uh, a lot of them won't be able to receive all of their funding at once, and many companies won't want to put funding in until they see that other people are doing it because they maybe don't trust that company to keep it. By, by having a platform like this, it allows companies to feel that it's a safe and secure network in order for them to, um, to invest and without possible loss if there's perhaps a pullout or a failing in the project, etc. Okay? Okay, so this is particularly particularly cool given the NFT space at the moment where you've got a huge amount of people talking about NFTs from you know Gary V, uh, Logan Paul, Mark Cuban, etc. who are all talking about how big the NFT space is likely to be. Uh, not, not necessarily now, but it's actually growing super fast. And we see if we were to go over to Google Trends, we can see that NFTs have been flying up in terms of popularity and in terms of search volume. With ProStarter, everyone can raise funds for blockchain projects through transparent and fair whitelisting. Moreover, investors will be able to invest well-deserved and quality projects by purchasing different tokens. Raising capitals for projects has never been this easy and professional as it has become with ProStarter. Future is going to be decentralized and interoperable with ProStarter. Okay, so yeah, as we know, you know, like previously, uh, there's been maybe a bit of difficulty in terms of getting in to the cryptocurrency space if you've got a new coin or a new project to be able to find funding and to be able to find people who trust you and, and support you uh, has been very perhaps very difficult and there's probably been loads of really amazing great projects that never really got off the ground because they maybe came across a bit of a problem in terms of how to fund themselves and this is what ProStarter is aiming to do is to be able to help companies and help cryptocurrencies get started and get off the ground uh, by providing them a safe and secure way to do that. Okay, so every feature has been implemented with an objective to bring ease and convenience and an environment of transparency to the ProStarter crypto community. We make sure our system is designed as per the requirements, demands of our members, 
let's have a look at some of the main features of ProStarter. Okay, so cross-chain swap. We believe in providing versatile approach to our members, which is why we are offering cross-chain swap support. Okay, you know, recently I've been using Atomic Wallet. I don't know if you've had any access to Atomic Wallet recently, but actually it's very difficult in that you might want to sort of uh, trade certain tokens and you need other tokens to be able to pay the pay the fees, etc. But by, by allowing cross-chain swaps, it actually makes life significantly easier for people uh, to move cryptocurrencies around as well as provide funding to other cryptocurrencies. Uh, whitelisting, bringing an ideal platform to host IDEO whitelisting for startups and companies to raise funds for blockchain projects. Uh, fixed swap token pools, offering the facility of fixed swap token pools for giving the freedom of swapping tokens in specific pools for our members. Okay, so that's another advantage of, of getting in board on this, uh, on this ICO where you'll have the opportunity to do these things. Uh, KYC verification, a complete KYC verification support has been provided by integrating with BlockPass, a professional and well-reputed eKYC technology. Okay, some cool features to talk about here. Permissionless listing, allowing Plot tokens holders to use protocol for creating launch fixed swap token pools in a truly decentralized environment. Anti-scam, the team of ProStarter has implemented all kinds of measures and scripts to make sure the system is free from any kind of scam and fraud. And governance model, as we've talk, talked about before with other cryptocurrencies like Zilliqa, they give you uh, rewards for staking, etc., by giving you uh, governance tokens. Now, the governance model is key in many ICOs because it gives the holder an ability to actually make a difference or to, uh, to be able to affect the way things are done with their investment, right? So this is really cool and something that, you know, once you own more of the token, you get more of a say in how things work as well as other kind of advantages, which we'll come on to in a minute. Okay, so you've probably heard the word DeFi banded around a lot, but what makes ProStarter a unique DeFi platform? The probability of having loopholes in every project is always there and DeFi platforms are not any different. There are many DeFi platforms working in the crypto market offering whitelistings and many other features, but still have to face issues. We'll go through some of our core features that make ProStarter unique and better than other platforms. Okay, so premium projects, and like other DeFi platforms, ProStarter only brings premium and well-deserving blockchain projects for fundraising in whitelisting. Uh, One-time KYC, in every DeFi platform, you must submit KYC to get your information verified before you participate in any token sale or project's IDEO whitelisting, which is what I drew your attention to earlier. Okay, so this video is actually on YouTube. I'll leave a link, uh, not only a link for the white paper, but also a link for this video uh, if you want to go and check that out after this video to find out more information about it. Okay, so something cool I've really, I really like about this project and I want to talk about here is dedicated support for NFTs, non-fungible tokens. Obviously, we, I mentioned earlier how big the NFT space is already getting and you know that the insane potential that it has as well. Okay, so the future belongs to digital art and collectibles. NFTs have changed the, the whole landscape of the DeFi crypto market. ProStarter is a platform for all kinds of tokens, but we always prefer non-fungible tokens. The reason for giving priority to NFTs is the uniqueness and precious value of these tokens. We are welcoming NFTs on ProStarter by giving 8% of the to total token supply for NFT-based blockchain projects. Our NFT ecosystem has been set up with the aim to promote NFT blockchain projects. And as you know, guys, so you know, like when things, uh, when you have like associated tokens or tokens associated with certain things, as those uh, other things grow in popularity, it only bounces back and makes makes the uh, makes the other association more powerful. Okay, so we got, you know, NFTs working with ProStarter, ProStarter gets big in the game of NFTs and NFTs go up. Obviously, you know, that's very good news for ProStarter and something really positive to think about when we look at this project. So they're trying to make a leading NFT marketplace, making it much easier for many people, many more people to get involved by knocking down the barriers to getting involved in NFTs and making it more convenient for people to buy and sell their digital artwork. Another cool feature that I like, and there are many cool features to talk about today, uh, is the Pro Kings on ProStarter. Okay, so there's three three things I want to mention. Guaranteed allocation. Okay, so one of the main advantages of Kings will have on ProStarter is that they will get guaranteed token allocations from every project hosted for fundraising on ProStarter. 
what I'll, what I'll look at in a minute is how you can get involved and how you can get on the list to be able to buy uh, buy this ICO as well as what, what being a pro king means. Okay, so Direct Allocation Pro Starter will be building partnerships and collaborating with many companies who want to promote their projects. Only kings will have a share in the token given by collaborations for the Pro Starter community. Okay, so opportunity to get involved in lots of other startups by being involved in this one as a pro king. Okay, so we'll, we'll look at that in a minute. Okay, governance vote. Another advantage kings will have over the pro starter members is the power to vote. Along with the pro starter team, pro kings will be able to decide the selection of premium blockchain projects through their votes. And we talked about this earlier on, which is really cool. So what do we need to pay attention to when we're looking at ICOs or initial coin offerings? Uh, is the roadmap. Many projects in the past produce roadmaps and maybe they don't manage to stick to their to their roadmaps and this can affect the price but as we come through the roadmap here guys looking back to uh december or around the end of last year uh we came the pro starter came up with the concept the idea the project conception uh product research and into 2021 they've already filled all of what's happening and we're not even we're not even through the end of q, uh, q1 and we're already into q2 and pretty much apart from the launch pad is the last last part of this so as you see so q2 uh key things to look at is the public launch uh, marketing phase one um which obviously you know once the marketing phase kicks off you're going to start hearing about this more and more so don't you know sometimes it can be a bit worrying that maybe we haven't heard much about projects in the past but you know obviously they they have to get everything sort of set up before they get involved with the marketing side of things and yeah i think you can expect to see a lot more marketing happening for pro starter coming up and it being pushed to more and more people. So you've got a really great opportunity at the moment to get involved very early before all of this blows up. Okay, cool. So uh, in terms of, so what we're looking for next, 2021 Q3, bridges and interoperability, building the connections across multiple chains, TRC launch and the NFT launch pad, which obviously mentioned is really exciting. And then into Q4, uh, typically we see scaling and optimization, NFT swaps, NFT competitions, and NFT marketplaces. Okay, so tokenomics then, 50% distributed through sale, 100 million total supply uh, of tokens, um, partners, collabs, teams, uh, teams playing the biggest secondary part there with 15%, and there, as I mentioned earlier, 8% held for NFT creators. Okay. At the moment, they're in talks with a large number of big platforms. And as we know, guys, once they get onto those platforms, they absolutely skyrocket, okay? So bear in mind, you know, we're very early on in the project, and this is like a really great opportunity to get involved in an awesome project uh, before it happens. You know, you see all these videos talking about, you know, 100x, 1,000x. Uh, obviously, go away and do your own research, but if you get involved in these these uh these projects before they hit major platforms, that's your opportunity to make these kind of gains. Okay, so how do you invest? Guys, come over to prostarter.io. I'll leave a link for this in the description along with the white paper as mentioned before. And you can see there's elements of this that are still being built. And you know, as we saw in the roadmap, you know, they'll be continuing to be built and worked upon. Okay, so the sale rounds, super exciting. Today is the 28th of March and tomorrow, the 29th of March, when the first private sale goes up. Okay, so the first one, as you can see here, the minimum allocation. So if you were to buy 10, uh, 10 Ethereum's worth, you get the best price, which is 10 cents per token. And as I mentioned, guys, you know, the expectation is that if it does hit Uniswap, or when it does hit Uniswap, I should probably say, you know, that price is easily gonna be a dollar in my opinion. Also, you know, like shared information from the Pro Starter team have given me the indication that this is expected in the coming year. Uh, also, uh, if you perhaps are not looking to put so much in, you can put up to three ETH, maximum three ETH, at 15 cents, okay? So just a slight increase uh, on the first available price, uh, but still, you know, 15 cents is very cheap if we expect this to hit a dollar or more in the coming year. Um, and then obviously moving on to the next rounds, round two, uh, there'll be 10 million allocated, and this will start on the 15th of April. Uh, and these are obviously gonna be slightly more expensive, so if you want the best prices, you need to be getting in earlier rather than later. And round three, uh, again, 25 cents. So guys, in summary, super excited by this ICO. I myself, I'm very interested in it, particularly because of its exposure to the NFT world, which is something I want to get more involved in. I want to learn more about. 
Uh, if you're interested in NFTs and you want me to make another video on NFTs, please leave a link below and I'll see what I can do about making more. Uh, just before we finish up, I want you to just look at the roadmap, see where we've been, kind of see where ProStyle has been and where it's come and the fact that it's well ahead of the game and delivering everything it's saying it's going to deliver and delivering it on time. And in the past, other cryptocurrencies uh, have said, you know, that they're going to they're gonna produce things on certain times and they actually don't. Ethereum, in fact, you know, being being one of the more famous ones who have failed to perhaps deliver on time sometimes, and that tends to lose people's uh, people's trust in projects. But as you can see, they're well ahead of the game, which is really cool to see. Really great team working on this project who are going to do some really great things. And if you want, there's, there's uh, links uh, here for, you know, live chat. And there's also links where you can get in touch with them on... Um, on Telegram, where you can ask the team more questions about it, see the marketing, see the latest news, and find out everything you need to know to know whether the Pro Starter is a sound investment or not for you. If you enjoyed the video and you want me to bring you more ICO content, then please hit that like button and hit the subscribe as well to be kept up to date with all of the latest happening in the cryptocurrency market. Guys, thanks very much for your time. Look forward to seeing you on another video tomorrow. Thank you and bye bye.